What? Drive Fowler. Go on to Fowler. All right. Fowler it is. East to Fowler. Oh, yeah. Oh, don't do that. Okay, I think I... Oh, come on. Yes, I take a left. Go back the way I came. <clears throat> All right, there's two lanes, so I don't have to fight the UPS truck. Uh, that person is in the outer lane, so I can turn in. Just had some shrimp with my tomato sauce. I feel they went together pretty well. I think I should like to have more shrimp in the future because they sell them pre they sell them cooked in the bag. They're frozen. Frozen cooked shrimp. I could live with that. <laughs> Not every day. Have eggs one day, shrimp the next. Then no no meats the next day. Maybe shrimp two to three times a week. Maybe that's too much. I don't know. But that's a good way to avoid the canned foods. But is shrimp safe in large amounts? 2.3 miles to go. 4680 elevation. Less than 5,000. Oh yeah, that's down a little bit. Gonna roll down the back window on the passenger side. My passenger side. <clears throat> this is my path. I still call it the passenger side. Yeah, the library didn't open up till 12 noon. It's at, it's almost 1. Oh my god, what is 50? Uh-oh. Gotta pick up the pace. So I displayed it at this library that opens at 10 a.m. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, do I okay, I take a left in two miles. I flew the drone around here, then recharged it. So, ready to go right away, anywhere, anytime. Anything that looks interesting for a drone. Which everything does. I could fly over, I could go for flying over all of this. Really. I love to fly over things. It's a very, very, very nice to have that view. For up to 400 feet up, I think it's reasonable to, to limit the drones to 400. You get too high and Things just become too small. You might as well be looking at Google Maps. After over 400 feet above, Google Maps might stop at about a thousand feet. But still, you, you get into that territory where you just you lose too much detail. Things are too small. I, I like being a under 400 feet. Depends on what's being recorded. Okay, a left, a left on 233. Oh, wait a second. I don't think I want that. No, I'm not going to take that. I saw on Google Maps that I could take like this back road. I'd rather avoid the highway. So. I believe that this uh, this road I'm on actually is good enough. 45. You're just trying to get me to the faster. Yeah. I don't know about that. Baxter. It's called Baxter. So what the heck? I'll stay in this. I'll get in this right lane and make it a little bit more of a. Okay, here. I went through and now I got nine miles, nine and a half miles, Avondale and eight miles. I don't need the speed, 50, oh my god, okay. Business loop? Yeah, I'd rather not be on the highway. Wow, look at all those pumpkins. They cleared out all the trash. And they got pumpkins all over. You wouldn't see that from the highway. Nice rows of pumpkins. That's what I'd like to fly the drone over. Man. I 
saw one, but it's full of weeds. Stop right here and yeah, take the fly the drone right off the top of my car. God. do that man that'd be kind of fun flying around the pumpkin patch geez I got so much imagination for that I, I can just see myself just running around getting all nice and tired running oh I don't do that enough 45 got gotcha. you not a problem Bonnie's paint and body I want to see Bonnie's body I don't care about her paint. Hey! For sale. <laughs> it's like saying, hey, the house is for sale or something. Somebody actually took the time to invest money in a in a vinyl sign to, to sell hay. Pueblo County Hornets. I've never seen a, a school call themselves the Hornets an ins after an insect. Must Farms just ahead. Okay, it looks like I gotta take a right, which I don't want to do. Right lane must turn right. Right, the right lane is writing a tight turn right, right now. Right lane must turn right, right now. Property with the cow. I got a cut. See, that's the thing. That's the, oh, these oh, these uh, on the outskirts. You'll see people. Yep, there's some uh, some goats just laying around. They don't have anything to chew on. It's just it's like there's no grass. They need more space. You need to either eliminate goats. Or increase your space. Some people are so bad at that management. I say you always want to lean towards having more than enough vegetation. Never lean towards not having enough. Okay? There needs to be like regulations against that. It's really disheartening to see. And it's pretty clear to see just walking by. What do they call it? Chili peppers! On the left there's chili peppers, on the right some, I don't know, some kind of hay, like lemongrass or something. They have not harvested their chili peppers yet. And there's no fence around. What's that? I think, oh, I think they harvested roots. Maybe carrots on the left here. Chili peppers on the right. This is some unique farming. They got to set up a little different for this. Just green grass on the left. Maybe hay. Some tall, dark, some tall, dark vegetation on the right. I have no idea. I would need a closer inspection of that one. They got corn on the left, pumpkins on the right. Man, there's a lot of pumpkins. A lot of pumpkin farms. Dedicated to pumpkins. They got more than enough. They just sit in the field. More corn on the left, a little closer to the road. Definitely not harvested. Chili. One mile, Pantaleo Farms. That's an old building. Wow, abandoned. And definitely, you could inspect it. Oh my goodness. You could definitely inspect inside. More pumpkins on the left. This guy is hauling cabbage. The guy's got like two, three, four trailers of cabbage. Hay on the right in their bales. But they're really green, so I guess they need to sit out longer. More corn on the left. Wow. It's quite the time of year. Horses. I bet they'd love to raid that corn field. There's no fence around the corn field. 
hay in the bar in the barrels. The barrel hay. Nobody behind me. Uh, yeah, I'm going the speed limit. Phil's market. Let's see, so cucumbers, onions, bell peppers. He's got a whole variety. The very green hay on the right in the bay in the square bales. More corn on the left. A pizza on the road. There's only a slice. Somebody died on the left. Quite a funeral. They got Virgin Mary about two feet tall. Looks like a dry river bed. Oh no, there is water in there. Wow. So dry out here, it's a surprise. 55. Okay, this is it's a little too bumpy for farmland. It's a man walking on the side of the road. Yeah, he looks like he needs a ride. He pointed in the opposite direction. <laughs> he, I, I wonder how if it's more effective to make a sign saying where you're going. Oh my god. I did not have the points or anything. I just had the sign on my back. My backpack fastened with paper clips. And I think somebody was able to read that. It is pretty unusual to see people walking on the side of the road. They're not they're definitely not doing it for enjoyment. I never enjoy these types of roads walking up and down. Look, there's no there's no room for you. You could get killed. It's so dangerous. Corn there's a corn on the left, no there's corn on the right. Looks like a stable. There's horses in there. Corn on the right, a little green still. Weather feels really nice. I like this. And the windshield is cool. Some low-lying grass on the right. They're harvesting something. Corn on the left. Corn silo by Pesquiota Farms. Established 1950 in Avondale. So this is a part of Avondale, Colorado. Pumpkins on the left. Some kind of grass on the right. I don't know what the... Maybe it's a hay of some kind. An open dirt field on the left. Corn on the right. Tractor out of the field on the left. Dyna Grow seed. So they use Dyna Grow seed. Oh, look, they're hatched chili peppers, no doubt. Yep. Hatched chili peppers on the left. Some open dirt field on the right. 45. That's a good speed. Almost two miles left for a turn. Avondale. Oh, I'm speeding. 40. I'm at 50 like a madman. And I'm speeding already. Alright, I gotta drop in gear, I think. Alright, so this is Avondale. I didn't see any library pop up on the Google Maps. So I'm not really giving this much serious thought to stop in. Yeah, where I left was my sleeping spot. Pretty decent. They have a Veterans Memorial. 35! Alright. A potato farms. Chili something. Evandale resident team. So, Sunday service at 11 at the Evandale United Methodist Church. Rayal Disposal. Elementary school. We got a few cars there. Sacred Heart Church. Yeah, it's definitely a, a, a heavy on the farm support. I didn't see any stores also. Um, farmers got to go elsewhere to do some grocery shopping. They grow quite a bit of their own though. And you can ferment chili peppers, you can ferment the cucumbers. I mean, all you really need after that is a good source of meat to go with your your ferments and you're living pretty healthy and there's some cow right there so the farmers can exchange their produce with each other but somebody's got to make the jars you got to have like a, a potter so 
me to make big jars for the ferments, for the containers, a glass blower, uh, a clay, a clay maker. And then you need to find the resources on the Oh yeah, okay, 0.2 miles after here. Yeah. They go straight. So the highway comes back into here. Or oh I'm getting on the highway. Okay. 19 miles. Wow. Gotta shoot up the 65. Great. Fowler 18, so I jumped up, 44. Oh boy. One lane, that guy was kind of close. Prairie dog hole, dog holes. Dog holes, all on the left. different 